Hey everyone! Alright, so today I'm going to be doing the second part of my New Hampshire haul for y'all and I also realized that there wasn't that many things um, apart from my Target, Walmart, and CVS haul that I had gotten. We went to a mall, uh, the Rockingham Mall in Salem, but I didn't get too, too many items and I, so I thought I would also include some of the things that I had bought prior to the vacation with my mom. Um, my mom and I just went shopping a couple days prior to the vacation and I had surprised her with Manny and Petty, so it was so much fun, um, and I'm so happy now because uh, I, we don't get them all the time, but I like, you know, uh, to get my cuticles kind of like all cleaned up. I thought I would show you some of the things, it wasn't that many things either, but not too many plus not too many kind of adds up. Too much talking, let's get in the haul now, and I hope you guys enjoy. So I'm going to show you a couple of the pieces of clothing that I got prior. And you probably had seen all these items actually in my lookbook, so if you were interested in any of them, I will tell you where they're from, even though I always tell you likewise. But the first is one that I got so many compliments on, and I am pretty much in love with this dress. It is my favorite look at the moment, and it looks like this. It's like this hot neon pink dress, and it's like a skater type dress that kind of cinches in the waist and then floats away from your body and it's like kind of like a sweetheart kind of neckline kind of like a bustier corset type because of the detailing along here I really really love it and it wasn't too expensive either I think it was like $29.99 and this is from no other place but H&M my favorite and it's actually from the divided line though but I love it so much I also got this one from H&M and it just looks like this and it's kind of more like a fun shirt um, it says, I fancy the lead singer, and I thought it was just really fun to kind of throw on um, for one of those lacy days, and also I wore it when I went to the beach. So. And the last is this um, sweater, kind of mesh, oatmeal colored sweater that I got from Forever 21. I think it was probably 20 something dollars, and yeah, I like it. I wore it kind of like on top of my bathing suit. This bangle from H&M. And I really like it. Hold on, let me just put this bag somewhere so I can show you. It just looks like this. It's I kind of have to like stretch it a little bit and then put it in and then kind of like squeeze it. But it's so cute. I really like I like bows and I thought that this was really unique. Kind of like an architectural kind of feel with the bow. Something different, unique, and I really like it. This hand cream from La Cetain en Provence and it's the cherry blossom. Um, scent. I really like it. It's a hand cream I got from Sephora and I've been wanting to try one of their hand creams and I really like it and I really like the scent a lot as well and this was I think $13 so pretty good and great to try because it was like in the kind of sample area and then I needed an, a new eyelash curler so I got a new one and my other one was falling apart so this one is uh, the Shu Amura one. Now on to my real haul. I'll start with Abercrombie. I just got one pair of sweatpants. Oh my goodness like Another sweatpants, Vanessa. Two pairs of sweatpants in one summer. What is happening to Vanessa? I don't know, but I am definitely just going to wear these for lounging around in the house. Um, and I just really wanted a pair of red sweatpants for Christmas because I am pretty much in love with... Like, Christmas is my time. I go all out with Christmas. Like, seriously, I am just enwrapped, enthralled with Christmas when it comes. And, like, even during, like, this time, like, I... Um, started Christmas in July with my family and we are doing it again this year. We kind of stopped for a while but we're doing it in August because we are doing a lot of things in July so I'm the one who started that and I just really like it. I listen to Christmas music um, all year round not just you know during Christmas like I don't listen to it like, all the time but when I'm not feeling so great or kind of down I will listen to it or just feeling in the mood to. Anyways that was a long intro to the reason of my red sweatpants but these are more of like a red with like a bit of a pink to it um, but yeah I really like them it still has that Abercrombie like smell to it and um, yeah it has the A and F here has a pocket on the butt and these are called the Perfect Butt Sweatpants Banded Crop. So yeah, my other ones were like long. These ones are more of like a crop style. Super cute. And the thing though is I also saw the ones that I had got in New York there. And they had a huge sale going on. Like 40% off I think. And I got them. They were 58 and I got them for like $23. So. And I also got... Pro Longwear Concealer. I had seen I Heart Makeup 92 rave and rave and rave about this. I had recently clicked on one of her videos, the one that uh, she talks about like acne scarring, um, covering up 
acne scarring and then uh, or acne and then I've just been obsessed with her and her videos she's so pretty and I love her videos and she really likes this as a foundation but I bought it to use as a concealer and I really like it so far I got it in NC20 and it looks like so and then it's glass and it has like a pump which I think is really unique and I definitely do not need that much um, I do like a little squirt and then I'll use that on all like the parts that I really need definitely full full coverage and I use it just to kind of like dot the blemishes or what so the next place that we went to was Dahlia's Dahlia's yeah I we just stepped in just to step in because we never been in one um, and then I was about to walk out and I saw this huge poster of One Direction and I was just like oh one Direction and then I like my, my sister is like oh yeah you didn't see and I'm like I didn't see what and then she goes to the table with like all like the um, shirts and whatnot I'm like what are you talking about so she like walked me over and we were actually legit like about to walk out but then I just turned and I saw the table of like One Direction kind of related shirts and I kind of fell in love I saw this one I thought it was so like cute I don't think I'm gonna wear it out but um inside to lounge around I think it's just really cute and I really wanted it so I got it um so it says I love boys <laughs> with accents and I don't know I think it's just so cute and like so like not something that I at my age should wear but I think it's really cute and I'm just gonna wear it for like lounging around like you know and we also it was buy one buy get one fifty percent off for graphic tees so my mom my sister my mom my sister chose one as well and then the girl was like telling us that if you tried on a pair of jeans, you get fifty uh, ten dollars off. And it was um, came out to both like for both of ours like twenty four dollars, and then it was like twelve dollars each for the shirt. So I think it was worth it. I think it's just so cute, and I really like it. So it says, "I love boys with accents." I know that's so like <laughs> juvenile, but I like it. One thing from Fair Twenty One. It's a really small Fair Twenty One there. Uh, but then I saw, I was like just looking and I wasn't expecting to find it and then I found it and I was like oh my goodness and like I was so happy because I had seen a picture of HRH collection on Instagram and she had like arm candy and she had um, included these bracelets in it and I was like oh my god they're so beautiful I'm sure they're from like some expensive place no they were from Forever 21 I was like oh my goodness obviously the ones near me I couldn't find um, but when I found them there I was so ecstatic and this is what they look like aren't they gorgeous it's like gold with like fluorescent pink um, like string wrapped around and it's like a uh, magnetic closure which I think is really um, smart and it's actually a very sturdy one like I definitely would not think this is from Forever 21 but yeah that's what that looks like it's so adorable and it actually comes with two of them which is really awesome for the price of $7.80 so I love this right, so moving on last kind of place is um, Bath and Body Works I just got a couple of things. The first is, I'm so excited now that I can take things out of my bags and actually put them in my room um, because they've been in the bags for since I got home. Um, so yeah, the first is this tin from Bath & Body Works. It's a candle tin and it was $5. I really like it. I have a candle which I have not burned because I'm not really allowed to burn candles, but um, yeah. So I have this one. It's really pretty looking and it smells great because I leave it open and it does give some scent it's a little bit dusty embarrassing to my room but I wanted to kind of pretty it up a little bit more and I think it's really pretty with um, this so yay I just did this now I love it my favorite scent is the pear scent it's amazing I don't know why the fresh picked pears scent is my favorite I love it so much and so I got five for five of the hand sanitizers I got three of the fresh picked pears it smells so good like if you're able to like see one in the Bath and Body Works, just go and like smell it. That's divine to me. I love it. People might not, but I think it's amazing. And then I got the Papaya Melon Scoop and the Tropical Sorbet Float. So I got those five for five. And then I saw this and I was like, oh, I have to get it. And it's the hand cream of the Fresh Pick Pear. So now when I'm on the go, I can put this on anytime I like and smell like Fresh picked pears. I have the um, soaps of it, the foaming soaps that my mom always gets, and I think it's like seven for twenty. I made her get like a couple because uh, I want to use that for our bath, my sister and my bathroom. So for sure, um, yeah, I was so super happy about that. This is my kind of like surprise item. So happy about this. 
<laughs> this is my second Michael Kors. Um, this is uh, the one that I have. A lot of people ask me is a uh, Marc Jacobs. This is the um, MVM three zero seven four. In case you're interested, I also have a gold Michael Kors. I've been wanting this color for quite a while now, and um, it's more of like a summer color, but I definitely might even wear it in the winter. It's beautiful! I almost dropped it! Oh my gosh! I'm so sorry. Alright, so I'm going to take it out now and show you. It is gorgeous. So, here we go. This is what it looks like. My new baby. It is absolutely stunning. This is the Michael Kors. I will tell you the uh, number in case you're interested. This is the... MK5145 in case you're interested and it's white kind of like a resin kind of material kind of like rubbery and then um, There's gold detailing and I love that it has a slit those like slits there. It makes it so like precious looking. It's beautiful I am in love with it. It is absolutely amazing. So pretty I'm gonna put it on for you guys just so you can see so that's or maybe you want to put it on together so you can kind of see what they look like in like the face and everything it's just I'm in I'm in like head over heels I put them on the wrong like way but okay so that's what it looks like it is so beautiful I love it so much and I have been wearing it um, ever since I got it but I didn't want to wear it in this video because I want to surprise you guys but back to school videos for sure and give me any response um, Request that you guys have for me so that I will know what you guys want to see. I know that there's been a lot of back to school videos already. I've been, definitely been seeing them on my feed. And also back to school, I'll be doing up for the day weeks. And also back to school shopping. I already did some yesterday and I didn't want to include in this video because I want to do a big collective one. So that will probably be the last one of this um, summer. So before I go back to school, I go to back to school go back to school um, after Labor Day, so September 4th or 5th, I believe. Um, but I know people have started already, so good luck with school, all of you, and for sure I'll do a couple of back to school videos um, of what you guys want to see. I know I'm kind of like late on that bandwagon, um, but I will for sure get on that. So yeah, that's about it. Enough talking now. I will talk to you all soon. Thanks so much for watching. In case you're wondering, Nicki Minaj's Pink Friday on my Nails from OPI. Bye!